Uh, no, I didn't see it. 84 negative. Are you good? Me? Yeah, I'm good. Are I you got, hurt? I just got some glass in there. I didn't know. I was just paying attention to the right. Are you hurt, man? This is my car. I mean, you got some good damage here, man. Why don't you guys, yeah, why don't you guys step out of the car? Stop moving, stop moving. Dude, park the car, man. Am I going to jail for this? Hello, and welcome back to Legal Descent, where we evaluate your constitutional rights before they're taken away. Today, we continue to explore the world of field sobriety tests and why you should never talk to the cops and absolutely never post your criminal exploits on social media. Although, in this example, it probably would not have mattered what the kid had said or done. This video was originally uploaded by Code Blue Cam. The link to their channel in the original video is posted in the description below. As always, if you have videos you would like us to evaluate, please send them our way on our Facebook page, Twitter, or at our email address, which is all located in the description as well. An officer of the La Crosse, Wisconsin Police Department was struck by a teen operating a car just about a month ago. Hey, how's it going? Dude, you just blew the red, man. Yeah, no, I didn't see it. 84 negative. Are you good? Me? Yeah, I'm good. I Are you got, hurt? I just got some glass in there. I didn't know. I was just paying attention to the right. Are you hurt, man? It's my car. I mean, you got some good damage here, man. Why don't you guys, yeah, why don't you guys step out of the car? Stop moving, stop moving. Dude, park the car, man. It is work. Okay, your vehicle's still moving, man. Hit your parking brake up. Can you step out, man? Yeah, I got you. Yeah, let's get you guys out of here. Come on. Oh. Just step over here with me. Step over here. Step, step over here. Do you have an idea on you, man? ID, I think it's in my car. <coughs> Why don't you sit down? It's good enough to take a picture of? <coughs> yeah, please. Sorry about that, man. I was in my place. I had, I was running to my place. And I had a shit so fucking bad. I think I might shit my pants, to be honest with you. Okay. You gotta hand it to this kid. You know, he was pumping himself up right before the cop came to the door saying, Play it cool, man. Play it cool. And in case you were wondering, the urgent need to defecate is not a legally recognized exception to following the rules of the road. I mean... You're just not paying attention? What's I was I was not paying attention at all. Never make statements like this to the police. Okay. You had anything to smoke tonight? Me? You had a drink? No. No. I smoked a joint like three days ago. Woohoo! Three days ago? That is some strong weed, brother. Okay. That was it. I smoked the side in my car. But no, I'm not under the influence of anything. Sure, buddy. We believe you. Yeah, man. I think I'm good. I'm not shaking up. What's your name, man? Obviously. Jacob Slovak. What is it? Jacob Slovak. My license in my door. You want to snag that? Yeah. You want to sit down? I'll yeah. Take your car. Oh. I just bought that car too. Yeah. Oh. Total? Yeah, it doesn't look very good, man. I think my squad car could be totaled. What? I think my squad car could be totaled. Yeah, I'm sure. Do you have an idea on you, man? Yeah. <coughs> you 
Jet's got a jet or something. It's called a shit. Do we have a what? A jet. No. It's called a shit. I can. Not even see the red light and fucking. Yeah, it's all good, man. Is your car okay? Doesn't doesn't look good, man. We got that brush guard though, so that helps a little bit. You want to actually get up and move over here, man? So you're not blocking this traffic. Yep. Shaky, but the leg hurts a little bit, yeah. Okay, does it got any boot from what? Just from the hit? Yeah, I think I might have banged it on the console. Okay, for your yeah. car? Yeah. What happened? I had green light coming through, I looked to my right, and it just speeds right through it. Which way you, you were turning? Right? I was coming straight, he was coming, and he kind of turned off and hit me in the. You guys think right. it's totaled or no? Yeah, doesn't look good, man. Yeah, I would say it's probably the I mean, he's still wrong. You guys aren't hurt, right? No, no I'm not Just hurt. you two in the car? I have some fucking glass in my mouth, but... Okay. Am I going to have to tow it anywhere? We will have to tow it, yeah. I can't drive it back to my place. It's like three down block. Literally like... Three block. It's like, yeah, it's right on 8th and State. No, State. man, look at it. It's not going to drive. You have a pole on top of it. Well, if we move the pole... No, it can't be drove. So where is it going to go to? Well, who do you want to tow it? You can pick, or we can pick the wrecker of the week. Wrecker of the week? Yeah, just whoever the tow truck is. Did they notify the street department or anything? Don, I don't know. I don't do Don's towing last night. I still got a lot of money right now. You know what I mean? You want to go for someone else? Or? I could have a buddy come pick it up with a truck. So you, were you driving? Yeah, I was driving. Okay, you're not hurt? No, I'm so not what, hurt. What happened? What way were you going? Which way was I going? I was going this way. Which way? I don't remember. You were taking a right? Yeah, I believe so. Okay. I think I might have been like going like 30. And I didn't see it like slow down, you know? Did you have a red and, light? Uh, did I? I do not recall. Okay. You don't remember or what? Yeah, I honestly, it's just so fast, you know what I mean? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I know what you mean. I just bought that car fucking three weeks ago. Your name's Jacob? Yep, Jacob. What's a good phone number for you? You're not hurt? You're a passenger? What? Do you remember what happened? Uh, I was looking at my phone at the time, so like, I knew we were coming around the corner here to take a right. And that's, I think I was just I going a little bit too fast, you know? He's going to hit me for sure. So I kind of angle my squad, and he kind of angles towards like going west, and he strikes my front passenger real well, and he goes into the hole. Okay. So, all right. Yeah, I'll take the What did you say about it? Uh, didn't see the red light. Said he had to go to the bathroom really bad. Okay. Any signs of intoxication that you could get? Uh, he seems, I mean, he seems really off. CSE said he saw a bong in the car. Okay. But he said he didn't smoke in three days. I don't know how much of the investigation I do for this. Yeah, not much. Okay. You guys aren't hurt. No, I'm not hurt. And you don't care who tows it? Tows it? You don't care what company? We usually just call, like, they rotate for the weeks, but if you want a specific one, we can call them. Is there a difference in price? They're usually all pretty similar. How much will it cost? I don't know. I really don't know what that's a tow guy. You care if I want to go take a look at it real quick? Yeah, you can just don't touch anything. 
don't touch anything. Yeah, well, actually, wait till we wait till we because we still have traffic coming in out here. I'm gonna just ran over. Right, right. I'll I, let you look at it before we're done, though. Okay. I saw no, it's all wrong with it. Cause I just did a full fucking fresh build on build on it. Really? Bunch of new parts and shit. Yeah, it's beat up. I'm over here. I'm over here. Yeah. Okay, so I want you to be honest with me. You smoked some weed today. Yeah, I did. Yeah, pretty recently. Very recently? Yeah. Probably two hours ago. Okay. How much? How much? Like, do you feel pretty high? Because you seem pretty high. No, I'm not high. You don't feel high? No. I, I see smoked. there's a bong in the car. Yeah, I just bought it from the one place. Okay. Smokes for us. I'm south side. Okay. So when did you smoke? Two hours ago, you said? Two hours ago, yeah. At your house or where? In my house. Just at a buddy's. At a buddy's? Yeah. Like, south side, north side? South or? side. Okay. So I don't see the south side smokes. We want a new bong. How much did you smoke? Like, be honest. I, I haven't even smoked that new piece in there. How much did you smoke two hours ago? Oh, like a couple one-hitters. A couple one-hitters? Is that normal or...? Yeah, that's normal. Okay. Do you have anything on you? No. You can search my pockets if you want. Okay. Just hold, it, just hold on to that. And I got my wallet right here. Is that, that just a vape? Yeah, that's a that? vape. Yep. Is this a weed vape? No, not a weed vape. You can go ahead and test it and all that. You pull this thing out right here. Pull it up. Hey, CJ, yeah, it's CJ's. Here. Is here. You can smell the juice in this to do if you want to. Okay. You can go ahead and do whatever type of test you have to do on it, though. Okay, but you can put it back in your pocket. Alright. I'm gonna run you through some tests to make sure you're gonna be driving since you've been smoking weed and you got an accident, okay? Okay. Is that pretty fair? Yeah, that's very fair. So you don't really remember what happened or because you weren't looking or because you were going too fast or like kind of walk me through I what you I feel like I was just going too fast to be honest. I got a new car and. How fast do you think you were going? Probably like 10 hours this speed on it. So like 35? Yeah, 35. Um, and you were coming this way from the marsh, from like Menards. Yeah. You were taking a right here to go home. Yeah. Okay. And you didn't see that you had a red light or not? Did I see if I had a red light or not? No. Okay. So you smoked two hours ago, some one hitters. Yeah. Any, no. Anything else? Well, no. Nothing? Nothing. Okay. Can you stand with your heels and toes touching? Yep. Completely touching like me. Like this. And put your hands at your side. Hands at my side. Oh. Try it again, just like me. Okay. That's kind of bad now. That's my bad. Do you have any physical issues? Physical issues? Yeah, my knees are a little fucked up. Like, do you have a physical injury or do you just, it's just sore? It's just sore. Okay. Do you have any problems with your eyes? Eyes? Yeah, I had eye surgery not too long ago. When? Because I had lazy eyes or whatever. So they, like, brought them back. When did you have eye surgery? Eye surgery like a couple years ago. Okay, but your eyes are fine now. Yeah, my eyes are fine. You wearing contacts? Contacts? No, oh, I'm, okay. su I'm supposed to be, but okay. All right, put your heel feet like mine, all feet the way touching. Shoes. There you go, and then put your hands at your side, all the way no down at your side. Oh, like down my side. Yep. Can you see my finger? Yep. I want you to follow my finger with your eyes and your eyes only, and don't move your head. You understand, Jake? Yep. Keep watching my finger. Just track right. it with your eyes. Hey, you're not watching my finger. No, that's very freak. Sorry, I've never done this. It's before. okay. Just, just like you're watching it. Everywhere my finger goes, your eyes go. Ready? Okay. You're not able to do this. Me? Yeah. No. You're not doing it. You're like looking past it, for it. Just like if you were to watch like a baseball. Game. So watch my finger. You got to keep your eyes right on the tip right. of my finger. Okay? If you guys think I'm drunk or something, I can do a. No, I, this is just the test we have to do. Oh, I got okay. and I got you. I need you to follow my finger, okay? Okay. Field sobriety tests are only there to assist police officers in establishing probable cause that you are in fact intoxicated. These tests are extremely difficult to pass under the most perfect of situations, and I believe that they are set up to make most people appear intoxicated. And even if you pass all of the tests, the officer can still arrest you. The first test that they conduct in this case is the horizontal gaze nystagmus test. The point of this test is to check to see if you can track simple movement with your eyes and to determine if you are exhibiting a nystagmus, which is an involuntary jerking of the eye while tracking horizontally. 
The three indicators of a failed HGN test is if the eye cannot follow the moving object in a smooth fashion, the jerking of the eye is sustained, and if the jerking of the eye begins prior to the eye being 45 degrees of center. There are about 40 known conditions that cause this in addition to being impaired by alcohol or other substances. Jake is obviously failing this test. He's not following the officer's finger, and he's clearly not all there. Okay, stand normal. Stand over? Yep. Alright. Yeah. Give me one more chance to be honest with me. Alright. You're on something else. Alright. You're on something else. Uh, I'll be honest with you, that's a good stand next. Yep. Yes, sir. Yeah. No. Uh, you took that way re more recent than yesterday. More recent than yesterday? Just be honest with me. Like, be, be straight so I can get this solved. Right. Officer friendly is not your friend, and you have absolutely no reason to be upfront and honest with him. Now, in this case, there's really nothing this kid can say to prevent himself from being arrested, but there are potential defenses that are being defeated right now by his own admissions to the police. It is never in your best interest to talk to the police, even if you think that you are completely sunk in your criminal case. I can tell you're not normal. Like, so I'll, admit, I'll, take, I'll, take, I'll take a half, I took a half of one. Like Probably just, like when you smoked two hours ago, or what? Yeah, when I smoked two hours. You took ago. a half as Annie. Yeah. Okay, it looks like you took a lot more than a half, to be honest, man. It's messing no, you up took, pretty good. I took a half. I don't know. These things fucked me up. Yeah. I just got so much shit going through my main, mind, yeah. you know, and it's just. Okay. okay. All right, just hang tight with this guy really quick, okay? Don't go anywhere. Just hold on. Hey, Sarge. Yeah. Did you get pictures? Yes. Okay. I've got here. pictures of the inside. Yeah. Okay. There's not. He's on Xanax too. I got the stag looks like crazy. Yeah. Take your hands out of your pockets. I want you to imagine there's a straight line in front of you. Okay. All right, Jake. I want your left foot on that line, and then I want your right foot in front of your left foot, heel to toe, and I want you to stand like that. Okay. Just like that. Don't move until I tell you. Understand? This test is the walk and turn test, which is a divided attention test designed to give you a lot of detailed instructions and a rapid fire method to test your short term memory and your critical thinking. Again, not something that is typically easy to perform under pressure. The goal is to not only test the suspect's ability to walk in a straight line, but also to test their ability to follow commands correctly. Indicators that you have failed to test include being unable to maintain balance while listening to the instructions, starting before instructions are completed, stopping to regain balance while walking, not touching heel to toe when stepping, using arms for balance, stepping off the straight line, taking an incorrect number of steps, and making an improper turn. So, how do you think Jake's going to do on this test? Let us know in the comments below. Okay. So when I say go, Jake, I want you to take nine heel-to-toe steps down this line, yep. turn around, and take nine heel-to-toe steps back, okay? Okay. Watch me, I'll demonstrate. You're going to go just like this. One, two, three, all the way to nine. When you get to nine, you keep your front foot down and do a series of small steps, okay. and you turn around, do nine back. One, two, three, and all the way to nine, okay? Right, While you're doing this test, Jake, hey, look at me. While you're doing this test, I want you to keep your hands down at your side. Okay. Count your feet, count your steps out loud. All right. Okay. Keep watching your feet and don't stop walking until you've completed the test. Okay. Do you understand? Yep, I understand. Do you have any too. questions? Nope. Okay, get back in the starting position first. Right foot in front. Right foot in front. Right foot in front of your left. Right foot in front. Put your right foot in front first. Okay, now you can begin if you understand. Yep, just like I explained. Okay. Am I going to jail for this? 
Based on Jake's question, I don't think he felt very confident in his results. The next test is called the one leg stand test. We talked about this one in greater detail in our last video, and it is also a divided attention test. It's less about the actual standing on one leg and counting, and more about how well do you listen to directions and follow them correctly. Oh, right now, but no, probably not. Um, okay, heels and toes touching. Heels and toes touching. Hands down at your side. So for this one, I want you to lift up one of your feet six inches off the ground with your toe pointed out and just hold it there 1,001, 1,002, and just hold it there and keep counting until I say stop. Okay. Okay, watch, I'll demonstrate. You can pick whatever foot, you're gonna go like this. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, see how my foot is? Yep, like this. Yep, and you're gonna keep doing that until I tell you to stop, okay? Okay. While you're doing this test, hold on. I want your hands down at your side. Okay. I want you to look at your foot. Count out loud and don't stop until you've completed the test. Okay. You understand? Yeah. I'm not that good at balance. That's okay. Do you have that. any questions on how to do it? No, I got it. You got it? Okay, you can begin then. Alright. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, both of Keep going. One Mississippi, two Mississippi. Go. One Mississippi, two Mississippi. Alright, one Mississippi. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi. Okay, you can stop. Oh no, I can't do that. That's shit. okay. Do you know your ABCs? ABCs, yep. A, B, C, D, hold E, on, F. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You in school? Me? Yeah. Am I in school? No, I got my diesel mechanic credits. Working in Caledonia, Minnesota, farming. You graduated from high school? Yep, graduated okay. right from high So you know your ABCs? ABCs, yep. Can you say them to me A to Z, just normal without singing them? Yep. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, R, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Okay. Can you count fine? Fine, yep. Can you count backwards from 88 to 73 for me? 88 to 73? Yep. Yep, 88, 87, 86, 85, 84, 83, 82, 81, 80, 79, 78, 77, 76, 75, 74, 73, 72, 71. Okay. All right, cure of a PBT. Okay. One more. So this one, heels and toes touching again. This, is the, toes this is the last one, okay? All Hands right. down at your side. Yep. Out of your pockets. Sorry. So when I say go, I want you to tilt your head all the way back. Don't go until I say it. Okay. Tilt your head all the way back. Close your eyes and estimate the passage of 30 seconds. Okay? Measuring the pass? Estimate the passage of 30 seconds. Like what happened right here? No, estimate 30 seconds. Passing. Estimate 30 seconds? Passing. And when okay. you feel 30 seconds has passed, I want you to open your eyes and say stop. Okay. Okay, so watch, so watch me. You're going to go just like this. You're going to tilt your head all the way back, close yeah. your eyes, and then estimate 30 seconds, okay? All right. You ready? Yep. Okay, begin. One, two, three, four. Tilt your head all the way back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Is this supposed to go thirty? Wow. That's okay though. We can stop. I'm gonna have you blow on this. You haven't been drinking, right? No, I haven't been drinking. Okay. This will see if you have any alcohol in your system, okay? Right, right. Okay. Alright, big breath. Zero. You can take that tube off. Pull it, pull it, pull it. Would it come out as? Zero. Zero. Did you eat today? Did I eat today? No, I didn't eat. You haven't eaten any food? No. Did you not sleep yet. at all? Sleep at all. When did you sleep? When did you sleep last night? I went to bed around 8 o'clock. Last night? Yeah. What then time did you get up? Probably around 10 or 11. And then I was sitting at Koichi eating some donuts and I just passed out. Okay. You don't take any prescription pills for anything? No. I take I used to buy Xanax off someone every once in a while when I'm going through a hard time, you know. Okay. So my thoughts going through my head, you know, and someone's bullshit, you know, it's just yep. trying to block it out, you know what I mean? Yeah, okay. Come over here to this squad with me. Alright. You have, um, anybody in town that's sober? Anybody in town that's sober? 
that's sober. Yeah. You do? Yep. Okay. So you're going to be placed under arrest for OWI right now. Okay. OWI? Yep. And then we got some testing and some paperwork, and then if all goes cooperatively, you might be able to go home, okay? Okay. So I got to put you in cuffs, right? One more time. We probably aren't going to hit that anymore, but this won't take too long, okay? Right. Jake. Nothing on you, Jake? Where's my squad right there? He's How long go. am I gonna go to jail? You might not even go to jail. We just gotta do some paperwork. Can you put him in my squad, Connor? Yeah. I, I gotta go ask him if this is gonna be. Yeah, I'm just trying to be honest with you guys. We appreciate you know? that. I'll try to get you home if all goes well. Alright. Hold on, let me get my light open. Honestly, it takes a long part away. I'm like, you know what I Yeah, mean? it does. Alright, have a seat. I got some stuff to do and then we'll get going, okay? Alright. You okay to sit here for a minute? Yeah. It's been pretty busy, dude. No worries, we'll get it sorted out here. Two of them. You want to run the red light? Yep. OWI causing injury. Huh? OWI causing injury. Operating while impaired causing an injury. Impaired causing an injury? Yep. So hey, once once we're done with this, um, would you be do would would you be willing to do some more tests like we did on the sidewalk? Sidewalk, yeah. More tests like that? Yep. You'd be okay with doing a few more of those? Yep. So okay. you can. Okay. Hop on out. I already got it off you here. Just step your feet out. Ooh. Counting scout. All right. I just gotta lock my car up. Nobody screws with it, you know. All right. Uh, sorry about this, guys. It'll I, be all right, man. I didn't mean to hit your patrol car, bro. It wasn't mine. You sit on this bench. No, it was mine. It didn't matter. <laughs> They'll work it out once uh, once we get there, alright? What? They'll come in and get the cuffs off. You just gotta wait a minute. Alright. More charges were added, I'm sure, once they found Jake's buddy's Snapchat account and saw what was on his story. So we out here, we're running from the cops right now. We're going to 120. 120. You up right now. Yay! Well, there you go. What do you all think? Did the police handle Jake appropriately? Are field sobriety tests actually useful? Let us know in the comments below, and we'll see you next time right here on Legal Descent.